Hello, amazing viewers. Do you wish to visit or live in a town that is progressive, diverse, and tolerant? Do you want to be in a place where you'd no doubt feel supported and absorbed? Very well then, kindly sit back. You're about to see some of the best cities for black people to help you on that journey. For black professionals looking to thrive in the United States, it is important to consider employment opportunities and the broader cultural landscape, cost of living, and diversity of the cities they call home. Anyone raising a family has a list of things they look for when deciding on a safe and happy place to call home. While great schools and general safety top nearly every family's list, for black families, the list of needs and nice-to-haves also includes wealth building opportunities, environmental safety, education, health equity, and representation in community and culture. While these items should be considered in the overall makeup of any great city, black families have historically been driven into communities where such factors aren't a given. Post-Reconstruction era policies and practices like redlining are examples of the kind of discrimination that has positioned a bevy of black folks in places where equitable living isn't as plausible. However, the best overall cities for black families to live in are the places that offer substantial black community and representative cultural offerings, good public and higher education options, solid wealth building opportunities, and environmental and health equity. In this area, our methodology considered how easy it is to build and maintain generational wealth. A 2021 report found that 83% of Americans experiencing three consecutive generations of poverty are black. For us, building generational wealth isn't just about earning money. It's about repairing decades of systemic damage and ensuring that our children continue healing. As such, when choosing the best cities for African Americans to move to, we carefully considered places greatly feasible for wealth building. We considered factors such as the effects of inflation, housing markets, median household income, and the likelihood of financial discrimination as measured by the ability to get home loans and small business loans. In recent years, a notable demographic shift has been observed as black Americans seek new opportunities and vibrant communities. This migration pattern has been constantly influenced by various factors, including economic prospects, cultural richness, and a desire for social progress. This is what has bestirred in us the obligation for this video. In this video, we will be exploring 13 cities that have become magnets for the black American population, highlighting the reasons behind this migration and the impact on both the cities and the individuals making these moves. It is safe, however, to say that some cities selected have very few residents, but offer big city options. Others have some phenomenal work opportunities, maybe a foodie's delight, with various areas with restaurants, bars, and places of attractions. Before we continue, don't forget to support our efforts by pressing the like button. Share with family and friends to keep spreading these contents, and subscribe to stay with us if you are yet to do so. Now let's get back to the basics. 13 cities African Americans are moving to. With its renowned research institutions and thriving tech sector, the Raleigh area has become a beacon for black professionals in science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, STEM. The region's commitment to innovation and education has contributed to its increasing black population. A member of North Carolina's Triangle region, Raleigh has long boasted great property value and generational wealth, building opportunities for black families. It is one of the earliest cities black folks settled post-Civil War. According to the National Park Service, the city was a center for advancement and opportunity for black Americans immediately following the war, and that tradition continues today. Raleigh has a 12% poverty rate with a median household income of about $73,000. In 2022, Stacker reported Raleigh's black home ownership rate at 43.1%. While significant gaps still exist in black home ownership, the city ranks number 136 highest among all metros. Axios noted a 3.9% jump in black homeowners in Raleigh from 2019 to 2021, while black home ownership in the U.S overall jumped by just 2%. Home ownership has long been considered the most common way to build generational wealth. Thus, a city showing such significant growth in that area lands a top spot on our rankings. Atlanta, no doubt, has been an overwhelmingly wonderful place of settlement for black communities for as long as one can remember. 
Atlanta has emerged as a cultural and economic hub for black Americans, earning the moniker Black Mecca. The city's black resident population amounts to 33.4%, a high percentage for a large U.S. city. Boasting a thriving music and film industry, a robust job market, and a rich African-American history, Atlanta has become an appealing destination for those seeking both professional and cultural fulfillment. You can't mention one of the best cities for black people and not mention Atlanta. Even though the ratio may be slightly lopsided with regards to the ratio of single women to men, it should still be high on your list as a favorite for black singles. Home to many historically black colleges and universities, HBCUs, as well as predominantly white institution, PWI, this city has a high number of black graduates. In addition, economically, Atlanta is home to several Fortune 500 companies. These organizations have substantial black employee populations, including giants like AT&T, Delta Airlines, Coca-Cola, to name a few, but now tech giants like Amazon, Microsoft, and Salesforce have started making their way down. Atlanta also showed a spike in black home ownership in the same Axios report, with a 4.6% climb. Tanya Rapley of MyFab Finance has experienced life in North Carolina, New York City, Los Angeles, and Atlanta. She says Atlanta provided her with the best mix of everything. My first choice was based on occupational opportunities that allow for advancement and salary growth coupled with a relatively affordable housing market and affordable cost of living, she says. With pretty good access to jobs, a low cost of living, and a cosmopolitan lifestyle where you can socialize, shop, eat, drink, and give yourself a glow. Up, you can't go wrong with Atlanta, ranking as one of the top 10 most diverse places for young professionals. Not many cities cater to African Americans the way Atlanta does. With its significant role in the birth of the Black Lives Matter movement and its diverse population, Atlanta is a place where black professionals can find a thriving community and plentiful opportunities. Another great place of preference is definitely Silver Spring. A Washington, D.C. suburb, Silver Spring, Maryland, has clean and safe outdoor spaces, inclusive cultural programming, great property value, and a well-represented black population. Silver Spring's earliest known black neighborhood was founded in 1853, although it wasn't until the 1960s that the city became a more equitable place for black families as it sought to welcome black homeowners. Today, the city boasts racial diversity as no race or ethnic group overwhelmingly represents its majority. Niche.com grades Silver Spring as an A, plus based on its ethnic and economic diversity. According to their report, 77% of residents also say they feel a sense of community. 33% of residents hold a master's degree or higher. The median household income is over $90,000, and the median income for families who have a black head of household is over $61,000. A 2018 report even listed Silver Spring as one of the few American cities where black boys progress as well as their white counterparts in adulthood. Niche also gave Silver Spring an A for its public education system, and it received a high ranking in WalletHub's list of the most educated cities in America. There, hospitals are slightly more prevalent than they are throughout the U.S., and the black maternal mortality rate is 28.5 per 100,000 live births making it a moderately better place to give birth than many others in the country. James Little, an award-winning artist and educator at Art Students League of New York, says that access to resources is high on his list of places he'd consider top tier for black families. Black families need good schools, great public facilities, affordable housing, and high-paying jobs, he says. Silver Spring is certainly the place. Although you may not have heard of this small town of about 70,000 residents, Frederick, Maryland should be on the top priority list for black singles. Just 50 miles outside of D.C., Frederick was ranked number four on the top 100 list of best places to live in America. That's an interesting commendation, isn't it? This charming town is located in western Maryland and is famous for its culture, art, and history. It has an extensive African-American heritage, showcasing some of the important black history rooted in Frederick. If you are a foodie, this city has great dining options and even has an abundance of wineries. Pedestrian-friendly paths that lead you by creeks, breweries, distilleries, and an assortment of rooftop terraces, your aura will be different in Frederick's. It even has an up-and-coming startup scene. 
It truly is an incredible mix of hustle and bustle, and peaceful suburban life. The cost of living here would be tough to beat, and it has a black population of about 20%. Montclair is one of the wealthiest cities in New Jersey with income levels hovering around 200,000, so it is definitely one of the best cities for black people. In a population of nearly 40,000, approximately 10,000 are African Americans. Amongst these blacks are people who work in law enforcement, hospitals, government officials, lawyers, doctors, and a wide range of other professions and industries. There is, however, definitely some residential segregation, as most of the wealth sits in North Montclair, and many of the black population live in South Montclair. But the progressiveness of this city, and relatively close proximity to New York City, cannot be denied. As a black single, maybe you should leave the big city life. With its small population of 13,000, Beaufort is a charming coastal southern town that could be a great fit. A good percentage, around 28%, of its population is black, and it is a lovely walkable town with numerous restaurants and a boardwalk with awesome views of the water. In addition, Beaufort, South Carolina, has southern country charm and some in-depth African-American culture and history from the Gullah Art Gallery Penn Center, one of the country's first schools for freed slaves, and an assortment of historic African-American churches. So, you could find who you are looking for here, or maybe you just bring them with you. New York City, a metropolis pulsating with energy and diversity, stands as an inviting destination for black Americans seeking a tapestry of opportunities. Known as the city that never sleeps, New York has so much diversity and opportunity that there are different communities suited to all kinds of families. There's a whole state filled with outstanding black communities, perfect for black families who are looking for perfect doses of vibrant culture through excellent education and all. Places such as Flatbush and Crown Heights in Brooklyn, Jamaica in the Borough of Queens, Mount Vernon in Westchester County, Bedford, Rochester. All these are beautiful places with a great sense of community and empowerment opportunities for African-American families. That's not all. We dare not leave Harlem, a cultural epicenter, historically significant in the African-American experience, out of the picture for a second. Its rich legacy encompasses the Apollo Theater, where legends were born, and the Schomburg Center for Research in Black Culture, a treasure trove of African-American history. Beyond cultural allure, New York City is a global economic hub. Wall Street, entrepreneurial endeavors, and a robust tech scene provide a myriad of career pathways. Initiatives like the Harlem Entrepreneurial Fund and Minority and Women-Owned Business Enterprises MWBE program showcase the city's commitment to fostering black-owned businesses, creating a fertile ground for economic empowerment. In addition, education thrives in the city's academic institutions, from Columbia University to Medgar Evers College offering avenues for intellectual growth. In Rochester, for instance, where inhabitants are provided with quality of life and historical significance in the African-American community, education is a big component here, as organizations like the Urban League of Rochester offer black students scholarships along with other educational programs. There's also a promising job market present in this city, as Fortune 500 companies such as Xerox and Bausch & Lomb based here provide promising job opportunities for the youth living in this city. New York City beckons as a place where culture, commerce, and community converge, inviting black Americans to not only chase their dreams, but to contribute to the vibrant narrative of a city that thrives on diversity and ambition. African Americans have been a part of Oakland throughout most of its 167-year history. They have been an essential part of its rise from a mid-19th century fledgling railroad town to the major West Coast port city, thriving tech hub, and trendy tourist attraction it is today. Oakland needs black people to return as well. It was almost majority black in the 1980s, hovering around 48%. But over the past decades, the black population has continued to dwindle. In fact, Oakland's population went up 50,000 between 2010 to 2020, but the black population went down by 7% and is now at 20%. I am sure the pandemic helped to expedite this shift as well. Oakland is home to where the Black Panther Party was founded. West Oakland was once called the Harlem of the West, and it had its own series of nightclubs and bars near the current-day Mandela Marketplace and the West Oakland BART station. 
Oakland was also called the West Coast Center of Blues Music. There is so much history here that we cannot afford to lose. So singles, you got this. That gal or girl you may be looking for could be in Oakland. Washington, D.C. is without a doubt one of the best cities for black people. It has an ocean of opportunities for entrepreneurs and black professionals. It has renowned universities like Howard University, George Washington University, and Georgetown. It is a well-paying city with one of the highest numbers of black internship opportunities, be it education, booming industries, clubbing, museum, or sightseeing, this city has it all. Historically, D.C. was the first majority black city in the U.S. starting in 1957. It was once 70% black as a result of the Great Migration, where black people left the South and moved north in search of better opportunities and to escape segregation and lynching. Currently, it is hovering slightly over 40% black, but still maintains the nickname of Chocolate City. Check out clubs like Bliss Nightclub, Club Timery, and 18th Street Lounge for a turn-up, or be a patron to black-owned restaurants like the historic Ben Chili's Bowl, Bus Boys and Poets, or Mr. Braxton Bar and Kitchen. Martha's Vineyard is the summertime sanctuary for the black elite, and it really is one of the best cities for black people. There was nothing like the annual July 4th turn-up on South Beach with young black professionals until it got shut down in 2018. Maybe you don't want to live here year-round, but summer in Martha's Vineyard is definitely the place to be. With its history of being part of the Underground Railroad and a meeting place for civil rights leaders, you will definitely be brushing shoulders with some of the most powerful and influential black people in the U.S. The island's regulars over the years have included Henry Louis Gates Jr., Obama, the late Vernon Jordan, and many more. Maya Angelou once described the town of Oak Bluffs, which includes Inkwell Beach, as a safe place where we can go as we are and not be questioned. Houston, Texas, known for its fluctuating weather, welcomes cultural diversity with open arms. Unlike some larger cities, Houston has no segregated populace, creating an inclusive environment for all. Houston is the most diverse city in Texas, but also the most diverse city in the entire United States. Diversity is critical for exchanging ideas, understanding different perspectives, and creating safe spaces, and Houston is at the forefront of this. The city features one of the nation's most robust economies and job markets. It houses the fourth most corporate headquarters of Fortune 500 companies in the United States. Dominating the energy sector, Houston's strengths extend to oil, gas, medical research, healthcare industries, and technology offering a wide range of career prospects for black professionals. Out of the 2 million population, about 23% are African Americans. If you wish to relocate to a new city, Houston would be a great option as it provides an opportunity to network and build with many progressive blacks. Check out some of the hot spots like the Spot Lounge and Bar, the Alley Cat Bar and Lounge, Lost and Found, and Rise Rooftop. It also could be a great place to settle down and enjoy black family suburbs, and relatively inexpensive housing compared to the rest of the U.S. Some of the best black neighborhoods, although they are still experiencing gentrification, are Pierland, the Woodlands, and Sugarland. Colombia has the fourth largest black population outside of Africa, and Cali is one of Colombia's highest rated cities for healthcare. The pristine beaches on the Caribbean coast and the vibrant nightlife are key factors to staying here. It has great weather for the entire year. With 70% of Cali's population being black, it is the country's blackest city, but it is also still very segregated. Many of the concentrations of black people that live in Cali are in Agua Blanca, which is also one of the more dangerous places. However, the hood is where the love is. You can connect with the diaspora and see them rocking their natural hair, listening to hip hop, soca, and Afro beats, a thriving culture of entrepreneurship, and see how the elevated consciousness and black pride are permeating across the world, including Cali. Cali is no different from the U.S., where systemic oppression and neglect have intentionally formed these ghettos. So while Agua Blanca is definitely a part of the diaspora that you should consider, I would also recommend taking extra precautions if you decide to visit. Chicago, Illinois, stands as a beacon for black Americans seeking a vibrant and culturally rich community. Its history, shaped by the Great Migration, has fostered a unique environment that celebrates diversity and resilience. 
From the iconic Bronzeville neighborhood, a historic hub of African-American culture, to the influential contributions of black leaders like Harold Washington, Chicago offers a tapestry of opportunities. In addition to its cultural significance, Chicago's economic opportunities are vast. The city is home to a thriving business scene, and initiatives like the Chicago Community Loan Fund aim to empower minority entrepreneurs. The educational landscape, with institutions such as the University of Chicago and Illinois Institute of Technology, provides avenues for academic growth and intellectual pursuits, contributing to a well-educated and skilled workforce. The city has been recognized as one of America's best cities for black professionals. Forbes magazine's Black Demographics report for the year highlights Chicago's strong presence. The city boasts a growing tech sector that has helped propel it into one of America's fastest growing economies. This makes it an ideal place for black professionals to find employment opportunities and grow their careers significantly. The city's skyline may symbolize its economic prowess, but it's the neighborhoods that truly define Chicago. Each area has its own unique character, providing a mosaic of experiences for residents. Whether it's the historic architecture of Bronzeville, the artistic vibe of Hyde Park, or the family-friendly atmosphere of Beverly, Chicago, offers a variety of living environments to suit different preferences. While challenges undoubtedly exist, the city, Chicago, has been a crucible for change, exemplified by its ongoing commitment to addressing social and racial issues. Chicago's resilience and community-driven spirit make it a compelling destination for black Americans seeking a place where their history is honored, their culture celebrated, and their aspirations can flourish. As black Americans explore new horizons, these 13 cities stand out as dynamic hubs offering a combination of career opportunities, cultural richness, and a sense of community. The migration of the black population to these cities not only transforms the demographic landscape, but also contributes to the cultural and economic vibrancy of these urban centers. This brings us to the end of this video segment. Did you learn a thing or two? Do not hesitate to share your thoughts with us in the comment section. Don't forget also to support our efforts by pressing the like button of this video. Share with family and friends to keep spreading these information and subscribe to stay on with us and always get notified for much more on the way. Thank you for watching.